Hello everybody, welcome to Two Minutes with PJ. Today's day is April 28, 2016. Our discussion is going to be on divided and divide. In Numbers 2652, Then the Lord told Moses to divide the land among the tribes in proportion to their population as indicated by the census. In 2 Kings 2.8, then Elijah folded his cloak together and struck it on the water, and the river divided, and they went across on dry land. Psalms 22:18. They divided my clothes among themselves by the toss of dice. Isaiah 11:15. The Lord will dry a path through the Red Sea, wave his hand over the Euphrates sending a mighty wind to divide it into seven streams that can easily be crossed. In Matthew twenty-two twenty-five, Jesus knew their thoughts and replied, A divided kingdom ends in ruin. A city or home divided against itself cannot stand. In John ten nineteen, when he said these things, the Jewish leaders were again divided in their opinions about him. Now we know from here that Moses divided the people by their twelve tribes. The Red Sea and the Jordan rivers were divided or parted by the hands of God so that the people could cross on dry land. When Elijah folded his cloak and struck the river, the water was also divided and he was able to cross on dry ground. We know that while Jesus was on the cross, his clothes were divided by the throw of dice. The Pharisees claimed that Jesus did cast out demons through Satan. He gave them this response, a divided kingdom ends in ruin. A city or home divided against itself cannot stand. The Jewish leaders again were divided about Jesus. I want you to think about this day. Let's not have a divided mind and let's believe on Jesus. Thank you and God bless.